Because of Abbott, I am a successful young man in the making, attending an urban high school in Augusta, Georgia. Because of Abbott, I find strength in being the middle sibling of eight, living in a four bedroom house with 10 people. Yeah, I know, right? It's definitely a little crowded. <laughs> because of Abbott, I am a curious young man holding on to financial freedom as my only hope while watching my parents strive to make ends meet. Because of Abbott, I am a change agent fighting to break the cycle of inca incarceration while taking the wisdom of my father. Be <laughs> because of Abbott, I am pushing past the fear of being uprooted from stability due to instability. Because of Abbott, I am motivated to surpass patriarchal shortcomings to secure my search for success. Because of Abbott, I have the opportunity to bond with educators beyond the classroom experience. Because of Abbott, I have established a family of peers speaking the native language with words such as TRFs, Socratic seminars, <laughs> phil <laughs> philosophical chairs, wicker, and slant. Because of Abbott, I have consistent exposure to college campuses, recruitment fairs, admissions counselors, financial aid opportunities, current college students, field trips, community service projects, community mentors, and leadership opportunities. Because of Abbott, I have continuous preparation for college entrance exams and standardized tests in order to expand the possibilities of attending my dream institution. Because of Abbott, I have a willingness to change a school culture focusing more on college opportunities and distracting students from things such as wasting time, being lazy, being hopeless, and settling for failure. Because of Abbott, I've established bonds with 35 individuals who started off as strangers but have developed into lifelong friends. Because of Abbott, the faculty and staff at Butler High School promote Abbott Fridays by wearing their alma mater t-shirts and taking the time in every class to discuss important college issues such as majors, financial aid, college regrets, and student involvement. If you live long enough, you will face adversity in many different ways. As a teen, the hardest adversity I had to face was realizing that I'm too bright of a person to end up somewhere I do not need to be. I found myself making a dumb mistake and hanging with the wrong crowd, which ended in me being arrested. This served as a wake-up call. I know that's not where I want to be, nor, nor is that where I belong. After being arrested, I was told I had to stop decreasing my potential of being great. This has pushed me to go harder. What Abbott really is, it is the guidance to make better life decisions and the foundation of limitless opportunities. Abbott keeps me on track. Without Abbott and my extracurricular activities, I don't feel I will be at this point in my life with the opportunity to attend college and create a brighter path. Recently, I and my 35 Abbott classmates graduated from the Great Butler High School. We are the first Abbott class to graduate from Butler and we acquired $1.4 million in scholarships. Without the support of my family, friends, school administrators, teachers, coaches, and most importantly, God, none of this would be possible. When thinking of my future, college is my only option. My success is limitless, and it's now time to show others the plan God has for my life. As a result of my preparation, I will be accepting a full ride scholarship to run track at the University of Clayton State University.
to run track at the University of Clayton State to study business and become an entrepreneur. I am avid. In the words of Chance the Rapper, all my days I prayed and prayed. Now I see the finish line. I'm going to finish mine. Thank you.